Hello, SNA2107 students, and welcome to this week's focus video where I'm going to take a couple minutes and show you how to access and use the templates that are for your journal assignments in some of the modules that you have for graded assignments in your SNU 107 course. First and foremost, I wanted to remind you that you have access to Office 365 for free as an SNHU student. This software is available to you and you'll be able to have like Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Excel, so you can do your template assignments in your SNU 107 class. Again, this is a free software for you through the university. You can find it by going to the help button, click on the down arrow, click on online student services, and that pulls up again all the departments here at the university. But if you scroll down to this Office 365 and other software, click on it, look for the Office 365 software, follow the steps to get it downloaded. If you get stuck, you have questions, reach out to your advisor or the SNHU help desk to get you all situated. Now, how do you find the templates in your modules when they're assigned? Go to Course Menu, Learning Modules, and let's start with Module 2 because that's the very first module where you will see a journal assignment that utilizes a template. Once you click on Module 2, if you go down underneath the discussion, you're going to see this 2-2 Journal Learning Habits. You're gonna see this guidelines and rubric that's highlighted or underlined and then is a blue color in text. Click the blue, gets you to where you wanna go. Once you click on that, it's gonna open up an overview of your journal assignment. You'll notice there's a quick overview, there's directions of what you're going to be doing. It's gonna kind of give you just an overview of what the assignment is. But under here, it'll say what to submit. You will see that you have this journal template. So you want to actually click on the blue, gets you to where you want to go, and it will actually download that to your desktop or wherever your downloads go. Mine go into my downloads. So when you open that up, it will look like this. And you'll notice that there's a button at the top that might say enable editing. Click on that. And here is your journal assignment. Again, you get that Office 365 for free, which includes Microsoft Word, and that is the type of document this is in. So what you want to do is you open up the template just like we did, and you want to read the instructions carefully. So this just tells you to complete all parts of this template by replacing the bracketed text with your responses. So that's how you answer the questions. And then you're going to submit it for grading and feedback. You will notice too that it says to revisit chapter one of the textbook for support with this assignment in addition to looking over those module two required resources section. So here's the questions. You have five questions. The very first one is what is your preferred receptive learning style? Choose from the following. You may choose more than one and you can pick between one of these four. How you want to do that, I encourage you, <laughs> is to either delete the ones that you are not, so you leave the ones that you are, um, or you can um, underline them, but don't highlight them because sometimes the highlights don't show up. That has happened to students previously. So you wanna make sure that your instructor is able to realize or understand which learning style you are. And it's okay if you're a mix of a few of them. So when you go through here and answer the questions, like it said, you can just type right in here. So if you're going to put your response, you type right in here. As you go through the questions, make sure you answer each one of them. And some of them might have a couple different parts of the question, kind of like question one. You're gonna pick your learning style or learning styles, and then you're gonna explain how will understanding your learning style help support your success inside and outside the classroom. Remember, you can type right in here, okay, y'all? Uh, the other thing I wanted to point out is again, as you're going through and answering these questions, you wanna make sure you refer back to the module two resources section and also your required reading for this module. If you get stuck, if you have questions, don't hesitate to let your instructor know. Again, this is just a quick recap of how you find those templates, how you use them, and then you will just save it and upload it underneath the assigned module. You will have a few of these template assignments for your journals in your SU 107 class. So it's important to understand how to access the templates and how to utilize them. If you get stuck, don't hesitate to reach out to your instructor or your advisor and we'll get you all set. You got this.